Hello guys, so today we're going to do planting of our lemon situ like here in our dragon fruit area like in this one we're gonna plant the lemon situ in the middle or what we call the calamansi I think that's in the family of lime yeah so we have planted more lemon situ before but I guess those are more than 100 already and we're gonna plant more 14 or 15 lemon situ here so like this one we have planted the lemon situ in between the four posts so one two three four and then in the middle is the lemon situ so all of this in this part will be lemon lemon situ in the middle so we have planted in this part but in the other side we need to be planted so in the other section in front i'm planning to plant more ginger in there or other crops that grow in between the pools of our dragon fruit So I'm walking down since Scott already prepared the hole where I can put in the seedlings of the limoncito. Okay guys, so this is the limoncito that we need to be planted here in our area in between the four poles of our dragon fruit section. Yeah, so we're gonna transplant this one since we're able to buy around I guess 20 oh no we able to bought around 30 plus of lemon situ that need to be planted and some of it was being planted already by our people here they trans they changed those lemon situ that die and yeah, I'm gonna continue at planting today. So, it costs us around 40 pesos each in this kind of big. Not really big, but it's quite enough because in some other places, they sell it like 75 pesos. And yeah, we're able to get it for 40 pesos and they give us two extra limoncito or calamansi. So I need to pull this up in the bag. I think they are also using a rice hull mixed with the sewer. So since Scott already prepared the hole, what I'm gonna do is just doing the planting and mixing the so well with the rice and put the carabao down yeah so i mix first the so well and the rice all. i don't have gloves today since we left it in our bongo. Good thing guys, today is not raining. It's a bit quiet, cooler and windy. Here right now and not that sunny, which is good to do the planting.
didn't planting on this one so I'm gonna plant more on this next to this one what I'm going to do guys is I'm going to use this star to protect the lemoncito from cutting when our guys doing the mowing hair in the dragon fruit area a lot of ants here we have to break the soil and also mix it with the rice soil because when we don't mix it with the rice soil the soil is quite hard especially some of the soil is bit like a clay so we need it to mix with the other compost This part is not really that clay, it's just a good one, like a dark soil, but we need to mix it with the manure as a fertilizer. I have to take out these grasses. The rice is not that old yet, and I'm afraid if you only put a rice on the plants, it might be the reason or the cause why the plants die. because. The rhizome is quite hot, and so that what we do is just we mix it with the soil. And during this time, during the rainy season, which is good, good thing, oh, a lot of flowers. Okay guys, so I able to finish planting all this line of lemoncito and good thing that Scott able to prepare the hole for me to plant the lemoncito in this area and also in this line. Yeah, I planted this one but I guess we need more tire to put in around the lemoncito so it will help as a protection from cutting during the time when our guys doing the mowing in the grasses here nearby the dragon fruit section and only in this part guys are the lemoncito but in front we're planning to plant in between the concrete post of our dragon fruit a different kinds of crops so that's for today guys please do like comment share and subscribe to our channel god bless everyone